All right, YouTube. We're here in the garage today. It's Sunday. Big buck on the box today. I got Jamie over here. Yo, what up? We're sitting here getting ready to put some parts on his bike. So we got the battery situation fixed. He already went over to O'Reilly's and um, picked up a brand new battery. So we got a couple of batteries over here now, but uh, the terminal on this one, it's just brand new. So we exchanged that because we literally just bought this like a week ago before we went racing. And so that's out. We're back to 12 volt. It's good. Um, our went out there and just pretty much sprinkled off the mud. It's not detailed yet, but we're there. Jamie's currently working on putting a hydraulic clutch on his bike because he said fuck arm pump. So we're about that. Excuse gotta my that language. Butter, baby. Gotta get that butter. That's right. That's right. So we got him a hydraulic clutch. They're still not badly priced from 10 years ago. It's about 300 bucks. That's about what they were 10 years ago, so it's not bad. He's got a whole nother box of goodies here that we're gonna maybe install. We'll see, he's got another clutch here. And so we've got a lot of stuff to do today on this. We got his graphics to put on from Spider Graphics. Like I said, we've got bar pad to put on, which we gotta take this part to get that actually on there. Um, go back through and detail it, check all the bolts again and be ready to go. The old Suzuki is a tank. I literally just washed it and uh, I'll change the air filter. We'll change the oil in the box today as well. And they'll be ready for next weekend. All right, we got the new hydraulic clutch from Rocky Mountain. I ran one of these in 20. I ran one in 2014. It was like one of the best investments I did for 300 bucks. Jamie, what you thinking? Uh, this thing is butter. You're in trouble now, oh, baby. Oh, God. <laughs> that thing is actually just butter. That dude. thing is butter. You can literally just do like one or two fingers now. I mean, that thing is smooth. She's in there, baby. She's in there, so. I didn't think that long. But definitely took two people yeah, to get that get yeah. that uh connected up. Yeah, this right here, this is a little bit of a pain. So good luck, y'all. Use a hammer. Use a hammer. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So now what we got next, Jerry? Uh, air filter. We gotta clean it up. Put some plastic on. Put some graphics on it. Uh, maybe do the brakes. I don't know. All right. We'll see you in a second. All right. So we went to Harbor Freight. I didn't bring the GoPro like I always do. I gotta learn to keep recording everything. We got the 9,000 watt generator. It's actually 20% off. So I think we picked it up for like a little over 600 bucks. Not bad at all. It's not the quiet one, which we don't care. Got the wheel kit and uh, yeah, got the Raptor. Jamie is currently working on his uh, graphics kit. So I'm making him do it. He's put them all, he's starting to put them on now. We're a little late in the day, but we're, we're getting there. So we've got, we're, he's already got the Sacras on there. Uh, the plastics are on the back. The new air filter is in the back. And uh, yeah, at this point, it's just, you know, putting the graphics on. I'm back here working on the uh, new uh, Ober tires that we picked up. And so, got the new tires. They had some balls in there. It was, that's all they had in one tire. Nowhere near enough to make it work. But, you know, I respect the fact that they tried. Whoever decided to torque the wheel um absolutely just ugged that thing torqued it down and stripped two of the bolts so not shout out to the guy who did that to those wheels i was actually very very mad at you about 30 minutes ago i've calmed down a lot um but i got the wheel off and hopefully that one is not going to be as bad if it is i'm going to be bad again but we've got those i gotta put the new new tires on put it on the hoppers I bought a set of these bead locks, these um, ITP G2 older bead locks. I don't know what wheel pattern those are. It might be, I don't have no idea. I don't know if they're Yamaha or what, but it does not fit a Yamaha Suzuki. I mean, a Honda Suzuki. So it might be Yamaha, it might be Kawasaki. I have no idea what those are, but they're actually pretty fresh. I picked them up pretty cheap too. So, but I mean, you polish them up, they look really, really good. They just don't fit the box. So at the end of the day, we're getting there. We got a little bit of go. Uh, Monday, we're gonna pick up a surprise for you guys, two surprises for you guys. 
and uh, we'll see you here in a little bit. We're still listening to the Dirt Box. They ain't finished yet. Go Stu Baylor. Jamie, any thoughts, concerns, comments? I just, I'm going to be here all night. <laughs> he's a perfectionist, and so it took him literally 10 minutes just to put this side on. So, yeah, he's going to be here for a while, but. Yep. You like get it done. You going to get it done? You going to finish the race? I'm going to try. If not, I'll look good sitting on the side of the road. <laughs>
I'm asking 31 for it. Insert plug for car. I'm trying to get another truck because obviously racing. This is just a toy um, and I only drive it when we do trips like this or going to Hickory or Statesville. Anything more than like 20, 45 minutes. It's a lot more comfortable to drive and uh, also have fun in a little bit. So, driving to Statesville, North Carolina today to meet Jamie. Jamie has purchased something, which you're gonna see here in just a little bit. And this is this is something that, after my 2020 season when I got hurt, it was obviously something that I got very spoiled with. I'm not sure I don't know who Jamie was. I'm Jamie. That's the one are? buying it, it's him. I'm Tim. his brother. Yeah, his brother. Tim, okay. Nice to meet you, Nick. Jamie. Nice to meet you, Nick. Jamie. Good. Yeah. You good. You good if I go, bro? Yeah. All right, good. Cool. You ever owned a camper before? I have not. He has. Oh, yeah. I have. First time. Right. Appreciate so it. So when y'all are done with that, we'll do paperwork. When you're done with that, he'll get you know take you through retail, get sewer hoses, and this, the bare essential shit he needs to camp. Perfect. Is he gonna live in? Or not? We have a Group 24 battery. Is that a new one? Yes, sir. All right, cool. I'll get a straight for that. Seven way, this is going to control all your lights, brakes, all that good stuff. Um, and then breakaway cable, this is here for just in case if the truck and trailer come up. Um, this is your cord, so when we're done, I'll throw this in that front compartment. Don't forget. I won't. <laughs> um, this one here is going to be for city water. So if you go to the parks or you're at the house, you just plug the hose straight into this. Yeah. This will get water to all your fixtures. Okay. The one on the right is the black tank flush. The only time you're going to use that is when you're dumping your tanks. The, and that's going to be down here. Left will be gray tank, so that's going to be shower and sinks. Yep. Right's going to be to, uh, black tank, and that's going to be toilet only. Okay. So the only time you'll hook water to this is when this is pulled and you're dumping your sewage. It's, it's purging this pretty much. Yes, it's, and it cleans out that tank. What right. happens if you don't have that valve pulled is the only place for it to go is up. Well. Okay. And then there's a little grease catch here. For storing it, they have this in the front compartment. Um, you just pull these little pins out. Kill the gas. And then you can slide the whole grill. Alright, so we're heading inside. <laughs> From the inside, this is going to be your deadbolt. Yep. Um, and then, if you just wanted just the screen door closed, you can latch it like that and pull this over. Okay. Control board here. So, porch light is going to be the LED strip on the awning. Um, electric and gas switches here. That's going to be for the water heater out there. So, electric is going to be 110. Gas is going to be a mixture of your battery and the LP gas. Okay. And then the pump, that's your water pump, so that's just pulling water out of that fresh tank and putting it to all your fixtures. And the ceiling light's gonna be your main entry lights here. Okay. Uh, in. And then this switch is gonna be for the slide room. Neat. There's nothing else fancy we need to do for the like hot water for the shower. Nope, once you, once you turn on the water heater, whether you're plugged in and using 110 or you're using the gas and the battery, mm -hmm. either one. Um, if you are somewhere where you are plugged in, I'd recommend just using the 110. And then if people are taking back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back showers, I would flip both on. Okay. So Get just, the water hotter faster. I got you. So is there anything we need to do out there to get the, the water hot? Do we, so when we get because we, we... Everything's right here. Right there. Okay. okay. So when we... Camping. We're dry camping. We okay. race, four-wheelers, yep. and we're just in the field, dude. Okay. We just go out in the field. So I would highly recommend filling up that fresh tank. Yeah. And then um, if you're dry camping, you'll just be using the, the gas. Unless you have a generator that you're going to be plugged in. We do. Into, we have a 9,000 watt generator. Then you can turn we're, it on electric. Yeah, because we'll, we'll, we'll run the generator. As soon as we get there, we cut it on. He'll be, he'll be, char he'll be getting this cold before he gets there. You know what well, I mean? As long as, so this is, I don't, they always seem to shift around when you're driving. These girls are super awesome. So all you gotta do is turn that over and then 
to ignite it with the one on the left. Oh, that's freaking sweet. Dang, this one on the bottom. It's way easier well. than the one I have. Oh, yeah, it does. So what I like to do is get it on that flame, hold the knob down, and then I'll generally watch back there off the glass. Back here, once you have that pilot light, light lit, you can hold it for another maybe five, ten seconds, mm -hmm. and then you can let it go, and then you can spin that knob over. Okay, that's oh, how you get the oven on. Okay. Oh, okay. I got you. Cool. Those on and just see what you, yeah, see what, what you like about it. Okay. okay. Uh, this guy here is for the previous owners had uh, Wi-Fi. That's okay. what I thought that's it was. was. Yeah, because yeah, well, yeah, I have it on high. That'll dump right out of there if you if you guys are just hanging out in here. Yeah. Um, if not, you can flip that close and it'll send air through the whole unit. <laughs> All right. Sucks for people in the lobby. So <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, Cody gonna be sleeping in the lobby. Yes. Okay. Sorry, dude. You're good. On. Yeah. Okay. If you're I'll get using a lot, a lot of stuff. Let's get a pack of fuses from my like, Arales. Yeah. Or yeah, we'll get a pack of fuses. Oh yeah, Jamie, feel that. Oh yeah. Uh, get that cold, 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 cold. Are you going to be winterizing this thing on your own? Uh, All right, Jamie. What are you thinking? I'm excited, man. Check this bad daddy out. Got to we'll be camping in style. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't going to be driving to the race and home on Saturday, right? That's right. This is going to make it a whole weekend. Super whole excited. weekend, yeah. dude. I, um, I can't wait. I can't wait for Pines on 9. Maybe not the track, but definitely the, the, camping. <laughs> the camping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is going to be a good weekend, boys. So gonna be a long week just to get there yeah we're getting there though we'll see you at the house in just a little bit are you catching your clutch oh yeah we're good at that. all right all right you ready to get the generator get the rv plugged up we're gonna see if it works i don't know we're gonna try we're gonna try but we're gonna get to it i don't want to go to work tomorrow Are you blind, my boy? <laughs> Thank God for the street light. Not only am I blind, I'm, I'm fucking dumb. Well, I could have told you that. Is it? Oh, it's fucking... It's locked, but it didn't latch. Bro, I can't see! Hey, how are you? you? got it? You got it. <laughs> Alright, Jamie. A little, it's a little dark, but... Ultra. Hold on, turn this way, turn this way. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let, me, let me get in the lock. Alright. What do you think? <laughs> we'll see you this weekend. <laughs> it took a day just to get it here. Yeah, it took a whole day to get here. It's oh. in my front driveway crooked. That's not my fault, again. <laughs> but we're here. We got T minus Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, three days until day of race. Yep. <laughs> and she's locked, so don't try anything. 